the value of root 5 of root 5 of root 5 as here in the second case this is up to infinity in that case you can directly write 5 as your answer but here this is not up to infinity so take the innermost four term or you can use the formula n raised to 2 raised to t minus 1 divided by 2 raised to t either you use this formula or take the innermost term which is 5 raised to 1 by 2 root 5 means 5 raised to 1 by 2 now if you ignore this first term this is equal to root of 5 raised to 1 into 5 raised to 1 by 2 which is equal to root of 5 raised to 1 by 2 plus 1 which is root 5 raised to 3 by 2 root 5 raised to 3 by 2 means 5 raised to 3 by 2 raised to 1 by 2 which is 5 raised to 3 by 4 which means here these two terms together these two times together is equal to 5 raised to 3 by 4 and you have 5 raised to 1 here so total root of 5 raised to 7 by 4 which is 5 raised to 7 by 8 option b is your answer here if you use this formula n is equal to 5 here and this is 2 raised to t means here t is equal to total number of square root here there are total 3 square roots so 2 cube minus 1 divided by 2 cube which is equal to 8 minus 1 is 7 so 5 raised to 7 by 8 here in the second case consider this whole term that is root 5 into root 5 into root 5 up to infinity as y then even if you ignore this first term the remaining term will also be equal to y because compared to this infinite terms of root 5 this root 5 is very minute so ignore this one which means I can write this y as root of 5y if you square y square is equal to 5y then y and y cancel y is equal to 5 